So we're back on this RV. As you can see, I'm on the roof. Now this takes R410. So this is residential uh, high pressure refrigerant. And just the tank of refrigerant sitting right here would be about 230 PSI right now without any pumps or anything. Okay. Ah, the motor makes noise. This is what we're checking. It doesn't cool down there. The motor comes on. So I'm checking for it. Ah, we got a little bit of cooling. So there's a little bit of refrigerant in the system. And then I'm feeling to see if it gets cold across where it stops to determine there's enough refrigerant to like only make it through the first tubes and then the superheat is so high there's so little refrigerant it can't cool in the further back tubes here and there's almost nothing going on I can feel something but almost nothing going on there uh, this has been sitting out in the sun for a while so it's hot there's no cooling happening okay you can turn it off so we don't have the fan, so I can't force air through there to get it down. But I know it's operating, so that's a good thing. So I'll cut this off. First, I'll put a tap on it. I'll suck out the refrigerant and recover it. Cut it off, braze on a fitting, do a evacuate and recharge, and it should be good to go.